Okay. So hello, it's Adrian. Um, I have got on a combination of new uh, stuff that I just um, haven't had time to play with and some old uh, favorites. So I have the Lumi Glotion on, uh, the Charlotte Tilbury Beautiful Skin in Cool 3, and then I also have the Pretty Fresh Concealer on as well as far as my base today. Um, I have been playing, like I said, with uh, some of my newer products that I got. And I did go ahead and use the LYS Unforgettable uh, for my base for my blush today. And then I went ahead and put the Bardot uh, by ColourPop on top of it. The Bardot is really pretty um, bronzy color from ColourPop. This is a swatch of it. And it's, um, uh, yeah. Uh, super shock cheek so it's more of a powder and the LYS this is one of the three that come in the LYS uh, blush packet for the holidays and this is a cream and so I mix these two together to go ahead and do um, the cheek today and then I did go ahead and use the Sky High by Maybelline and the I Love Extreme uh, by Essence as far as uh, the mascara and I use the um, It's Complicated by Oma. This is one that you can get over at Walmart as far as my lip color. And then the Tower 28 Cashew Gloss on top. And um, like I said, this is the Oma by Sharon Seed that you can get in Walmart. And as far as what I have on my eyes today, well, actually, let's take another step back. I have the Skin Lights by Revlon. Um, this is a really good highlighter, and that's what I have on for my highlighter today. This one's in 201 uh, Daylight. And then, yes, I do have the Harry Potter by ColourPop. And this is what it comes in. It's in book form and yeah it's a really pretty palette it's uh just a really well-made palette for an amazing series and i mean you have hedwig and you have all sorts of uh the broomstick and uh, just also all of the different houses and somebody put a lot of time into this and it's a really beautiful palette so over here, you have the green, which is Slytherin. You have Ravenclaw, which seems to be lost in a lot of the books. I, I was thinking about it when I, you know, first got this palette, and I'm like, Ravenclaw? Yeah, I don't ever remember seeing them a lot. Uh, Gryffindor is the red, and then the yellow is going to be Hufflepuff. I'm not sure how to say that, Hufflepuff. And so anyway, I went ahead and used green today. I used uh, this right under the brow and on the inner corner. And then I used this on the outer corner. This beautiful green here is what I have on the inner corner. And then my eyeliner is actually this color right here. And again, this beautiful palette from ColourPop, it actually opens kind of like a book like this. And so, yeah, I would definitely suggest it for anybody young old who likes makeup and loves hogwarts and all of the harry potter books so um yeah this is the way that the eye look turned out and i'm really glad that ColourPop did finally do a harry potter um palette i think that yeah the two just seem to go hand in hand and so i'm really glad that i got it and uh and really having fun playing with it. The greens are pretty muted and they tend to be in the sage versus uh, Kelly green kind of area. And so I think they're really appropriate for everyday work. And it's a beautiful palette and I definitely go ahead and suggest it. Um, and along with all the other products that I've been playing with. Um, and I finally got the time to play with them. So. Yeah, I forgot my bronzer, and today it was the F Essence uh, Sunkissed, and this one is um, available over at Ulta. You can order it online, or uh, most Ultas have Essence in there. It actually has, um, it works out as a bronzer for me. I think that some people can go ahead and use it as blush, but 
for me, this one turns into a bronzer, and this one is actually, it's from the same line. This one is star kissed, this one is sun kissed, and uh, this one I can use as a blush, but this one I definitely use as a bronzer, and it's very shiny. And um, so I'm really, like I said, enjoying all the products that I've gotten in, in lately. I hope that um, you're having a good day, and I'll see you later. Bye.